when it comes to scams, we know if it's too good to be true, it probably is. But what if the product, offer, or deal seems normal? No weird requests for gift cards or cash transfers. An ad for a high point rental home seemed harmless. Well, to once knows Kevin Kennedy found out it was anything but. If you're looking for a house to rent, there are literally dozens and dozens of websites designed to assist. Dorothy Wallace, Alexander, and her fiance recently going through the process. We have been searching online and he come across the um, ad. The ad was for this high point home, Dorothy calling the number. He told me he was the property owner and that he was looking to rent the house out. After filling out an application, Dorothy went to look at the home. As soon as we got here, he told me to give him a call. So I called him back and he told me the code to get into the lockbox. The house was perfect. Dorothy ready to rent it. I was just happy to be in High Point. I, a new city changed for me and my children. You know, we were excited. After a credit check, she went to transfer the money for the deposit and first month's rent. Took the money out of the bank. We had to go to Walmart and do a Walmart to Walmart transfer. The $2,000 sent to a branch in Indiana. The deal done. Within the next couple hours, we started moving in. About one week later, there was a problem. That owner wasn't really the owner. It was all a scam. I started crying because I was upset. My fiance was upset. It appears one of the websites Dorothy used was hacked. The phone number on the ad was the scammers. I've never been scammed before. And for somebody that has never been scammed, you don't know what to do. She called us and we called the real rental company. It agreed to allow Dorothy to stay for several months. I am grateful for what you guys have done for us. We're able to put that money aside for our, you know, our next place. As for this case, High Point Police and Michigan City, Indiana Police are investigating. No arrests so far. Dorothy has since moved out of the house and is staying with family. Kevin Kennedy, two wants to know.